Skysaver, our brand new 21st century ground-based air defense weapon system. A better missile, a better radar detection capability that we can now integrate with the Air Force and the Navy and communicate to some of their weapon platforms to be able to share a better picture to help us make better decisions that are more lethal and safer as well. The CAM, the Common Anti-Air Missile Munition, is right at the heart of the Skysaver system. Uh, already serving on our Type 23s and soon to be Type 26s, creates a really big saving financially and also logistically if you think about the production line and how we can use some of the Navy missiles to help ours as well and vice versa to deploy them wherever we're required to as well. So financial savings but also logistic savings for the new uh, missile in of itself as well. Well, our radar can almost look at an unlimited amount of things. It's got a certain uh, number that it will hit, uh, but it, at the same time it will also look at whatever is in the sky. Um, our launcher at the same time, it can fire eight missiles at once. Um, it's got obviously the eight missiles on the uh, back of the flat rack. Uh, they can be uh, distinguished between different targets that we can allocate a certain missile to a certain target. We can then use more missiles for a certain target. So if we've got um, cruise missiles coming in, we can send up three or eight missiles rather than just the one, just so we've got that assurance that we are getting the target rather than not uh, missing it. With Rapier we were used, uh, but it was very out of date, it was very old age, so we couldn't use a lot of it. Um, but with the new system we're used in everywhere, we've, we've got the capability now to deploy wherever we need to go. the smallest thing we would usually shoot at would be a cruise missile. Uh, that would be shot from anywhere around the world or any enemy target. We would then track the missile, track where it's come from, what it's doing and where its predicted point is to land. The launcher itself would then predict where's the best point to intercept it. So instead of going straight for the target, it goes for the interception point. So it's better uh, at hitting the target, it's got more chance to hit the target.